Just what are your, what are your thoughts on the on tomorrow's match? I think it's a hard opener. You know, I mean, uh, I don't know. I think they're ranked all over in the polls, maybe as high as tenth in some polls. You know, so uh, they final eight last year. Uh, Karen does a fantastic job down there, and they're <clears throat> I mean they're they're good, and it's obviously. Um, for a lot of our young kids, it's going to be a big test for them, for sure. For a for an exhibition, kind of, it's an early test for you to kind of see where your team is. Is that kind of how you want to treat this tomorrow? Yeah, I mean that that's you know, I mean that's really on conference, right? To some degree, especially if you look to see what we lost last year and the players that graduated. I mean, you know, you're losing two-time defensive player of the year, four kids who've been all conference pretty much their entire career. So, I mean, you know, it's six players that are gone that played a uh, ton of minutes for us so I think we're still trying to find our identity and what what works for us you know young kids and the returners I think we have have a good group but uh, a lot of kids are untested at this point in time and finally coach uh, over the years you and coach Hoffa at, yeah. at Auburn have kind of developed a a good relationship, but also kind of a rivalry between the two teams. Is kind of is it always fun playing them and kind of a good matchup uh, in the in in the season? Yeah, I mean, I think it's great, and one of the things I really respect about what uh, Karen's done down there is that she's done it on a consistent basis for so many years, and I, I really don't think she gets anywhere near enough credit for what she's done. And I really do appreciate the fact that they've always wanted to play us, and you know, sometimes scheduling can be a little bit difficult for us, and they they've never once. Uh, not wanted to play so uh, she's a really good friend uh, that staff and our staff are, are, are quite close uh, which you know you think in a rivalry situation that's not what really develops but uh, I think in when when you're looking at it uh, with Auburn and Sanford you, uh, you have a really close relationship and, and a really really two really good soccer teams.